All right, folks, so today is September 3rd, the day after Labor Day 2019. And I'm gonna do some lawn mowing. I mowed the backyard and this side section today with my Real Master 3100D. Love that machine. Makes quick work of things. I need to mow the renovation. This will be the second time I've mowed the renovation. Finished this thing last night. That was a project and a half. So happy that's done. It looks great. First thing I want to do is do a little bit of edging. I always like to do the edging very first. Got a lot of sweet dahlias. Lots and lots of them. They're kind of everywhere. Got some behind me, more behind me. So I got some white ones there that need to be pruned up. Got some pretty sweet dahlias over here as well. Fuzzy wuzzy right there. Man, that thing's awesome. So it's been quite a while since I've used this mower. I think I've only used it like one time. I don't even know if it's sharp. The guy I bought it from told me he was sharpening it for me. And that's not even cutting. That's pretty dang good over there. Wow. Not bad. Not bad. So I need to tighten this side up a little bit. That's way too much. There we go. So this right here is called a groomer. So what it does when you turn the reel on like this, okay, and it's cutting, what this thing does is combs the grass. So this roller right here will fold the grass over and then this roller here is called a groomer. It'll kind of comb the lawn and lift it back up in preparation for this to cut it. And then after it's cut, you've got the roller right there that flattens it down and rolls it over so this thing kind of rolls it over then this lifts it up this cuts it and then that rolls it so this is the first machine i've ever had a groomer or used it on and uh, i have to say the first time i used it wasn't widely impressed but i'm going to try it again and see about how it does so here we go i don't even know what height i'm set to so i don't know it could be set to the wrong height Really Did you know. sell the baby, the first one? No, that's the one I took to the shop. Oh, that one you got a baby. No. Yeah. That one's gone. I'm not liking the height, it does not feel right. So I'm going to check the height of cut. So this mower just does not feel right. So I need to check the height of cut. It's off, it's set to 0.72. So it's set to about three quarters of an inch. And that's not what I'm after. So I want 0.625. So you do that side and then you check it over here. So you just go back and forth, back and forth, checking the height from each side. And I'm setting at this at 0.625, which is 5 eighths of an inch. That is a sweet spot, I tell you what. 5 eighths of an inch has an awesome height of cut. It feels good and it looks good. This bolt over here, or this nut, and this bolt is stripped. So that is not good. I'm gonna need to get a new one for that. All right, so let's try this again. It just didn't feel right going around the first time. Am 
not so sure how much I like that groomer. I don't know if it's the groomer or what, but it's not giving me the quality cut that I'm used to. So I definitely need to do some playing around with that groomer to see the right setting for it because it's definitely not a clean cut, that's for sure. I probably have the wrong height on the groomer. very impressed with this lawn so far considering it was dead six to seven weeks ago it is looking great So that's it, mowed the lawn for the second time, the renovation at five eighths of an inch. And for all, it only being seven or eight weeks or so, I'd say it's looking pretty dang good. This is far better than I thought it was gonna look at this time. Yesterday I did spray humic acid and tenacity to help with the weed pressure. I do have quite a bit of weeds. I still have a couple of trouble areas this is probably the biggest offender for the trouble areas. Not enough water. So down here we've got some serious issue because this is where the cows kind of did their thing. But it's filling in nicely. So right here as well, for the most part, it's thick. So I do worry right here that I've got POA triv. I think that's the exact same place that the POA was last time. So that's a bad deal. Some thin areas through here. Then over here, I've got my real old dad dirt stripes. So this area right here is gonna have to be regraded, lifted up because I lifted my paver um, patio quite a bit or this walkway. Got this section right here that's gonna have to come up over there the same. Those trees are gonna come out and then I'm going to put plant grass there so so I don't know what you guys can see or what you can't see because it's kind of dark out here but that's it for this video thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one